The Indus Valley Civilization, also called the Harappan Civilization, is the earliest known urban culture of the subcontinent. The beginnings of the civilization appear to be about 2500 to 1700 BCE. Though the southern sites may have lasted later into the second millennium BCE, this civilization is among the three earliest civilizations and was also the most extensive, the other two being the Mesopotamian and Egyptian civilizations. The Indus Valley Civilization was first identified in 1921 at Harappa in the Punjab region and then in 1922 at Mohenjo-daro near the Indus River in Sindh. Both sites are in present-day Pakistan in Punjab and Sindh provinces respectively. The ruins of Mohenjo-daro were designated a UNESCO World Heritage Site in 1980. Governance in the civilization is a matter of speculation, but each city seems to have had its own governor and some form of centralized government in order to achieve the uniformity of the cities. There is not much known about royalty or legislature either. When it comes to social structure, it is known that the two best researched and excavated cities are Harappa and Mohenjo-daro which are thought to have once had populations of between 40,000 to 50,000 people. They seem to have been primarily artisans, farmers and merchants. There is no evidence of an army, no palaces and no temples. And the economy of the Indus Valley civilization was based on animal husbandry, particularly of zebu cattle, on and on arable agriculture, growing cereals, pulses and other plants. These were supplemented by the exploitation of wild resources such as fish. Pastoralism and agriculture differed in their relative importance in each of the great diversity of environments that composed the Indus realms. The religion practiced in the Indus Valley civilization is still vague and a debated topic. Some artifacts have been found pointing to some form of religious practices and beliefs but there is no clear evidence despite several theories. As the religions went on being discovered with many different claims being made, numerous statues of female figurines were also found and popularly known as Mother Goddess. Along with the discovery of female figurines, Numerous seals with different images and figures of embryos in them were also found. One of the religious theories is that the Indus Valley was under a matriarchal culture where a mother goddess was considered superior to the father god. The swastika was considered to be the most famous symbols worshipped which represented the sun. Almost every individual of this valley worshipped the sun. Harappa and Mohenjo-daro boast the world's first known urban sanitation system. The ancient Indus systems of sewage and drainage developed and used in cities throughout the Indus region were far more advanced than any found in contemporary urban sites in the Middle East. Individual homes drew water from wells, while wastewater was directed to covered drains on the main streets. Houses opened to inner courtyards and smaller lanes and even the smallest homes on the city outskirts were believed to have been connected to the system, further supporting the conclusion that cleanliness was a matter of great importance. Mohenjo-daro was indeed one of the most modern towns of the Indus civilization. It was destroyed and reconstructed approximately nine times and had three roads running from north to south and in between from east to west were two roads intersecting them to make them 12 blocks which were further divided into streets and valleys. It was also divided into two parts, the upper and the lower. The upper part was for the elite and the lower one for the working class. The upper was a sort of citadel which was 40 feet high and built on an artificial mud brick platform. 
One architectural feature worth mentioning was the Great Bath, a 40 feet long pool with waterproof walls. The prevalent view is that it was used for ritualistic bathing. On the side of the Great Bath was a tall building with small cubicles which is guessed to have been used for a college for students of religion including a residence for religious scholars. Towards the southern part of the citadel was a pillared hall. Archaeologists think it was used as an assembly hall or maybe a center of government for performing administrative functions. Why the Indus Valley civilization declined and fell is unknown, but scholars believe it may have had to do with climate change, the drying up of the Sarasvati River, an alteration in the path of the monsoon which watered crops over population of the cities, a decline in trade with Egypt and Mesopotamia or a combination of any of the above. In the present day, excavations continue at many of the sites found thus far and some future find may provide more information on the history and decline of the culture. The Aryan invasion theory, however, Though still cited and advanced by those with a racialist agenda, lost its credence in the 1960s through the work of famed archaeologist George F. Dales, who visited the site and found no evidence to support it. Please leave us any questions or recommendations in the comment section and subscribe to our YouTube channel to remain up to date. Thank you very much and we hope you enjoy our endeavors.